Good morning. Good morning. We had an epic day in Palma yesterday. Yeah, it was maybe one of our best stops, period. And then a big birthday party on the ship last night. But now we're in Abusa and we're about to go find a beach. Yes, a beach day is what the doctor ordered for our final day of the cruise. We're going to Talamanca Beach. Sad face, oh, final that's okay. day. That's okay, we've had a great time. So we're not gonna be sad it's over. We're gonna be happy that we got to do it to begin with. But That's a good philosophy, absolutely. But we're gonna go figure out how to get off the ship and get to the beach and we'll take you along. Sounds good. If you're like us and going off on your own to find a beach for the day, NCL provides beach towels. You just stop by the tent and check them out with your room number. Make sure to return the towels or they do charge a $25 replacement fee. We had to walk through the port checkpoints and just outside the gates is a building with a taxi stand. Before long, we were on our way to Talamanca Beach. Had a bit of a late start because we had a bit of a late night and all of the sun loungers are taken. So we're gonna go set up shop on a part of the beach where it looks like there's a little less seaweed. We're on their way right now. Ibiza is beautiful. We have finally made it to dip our toes in the Mediterranean Sea. It's taken us nine days and finally we did it. Don't you think? Yes, Okay. this is fantastic. The water's a little chilly, but once you get in, you get acclimated, it's kind of nice. So a few hints, get out here early. We missed all of the loungers because we got out here late, but that's okay. We needed to sleep in. We needed to sleep. Um, make sure you bring lots of sunscreen because there is no shade anywhere. And a good pair of water shoes is actually recommended because this beach is a little bit rocky. There is some rocks on there. I did not bring my water shoes. I am regretting that. So we're in the ocean. We're staying in this direction because this is a clothing optional beach. Yep. Um, keep that in mind if you've got children with you. Um, I'm so glad I brought my hat. <laughs> so glad I brought my hat. She hates her hat. I hate my hat, but <laughs> it's serving a purpose. It is serving a purpose. She, hates she did her not hat. bring her hat. Not, I'm going to have a sunburn. It's all good. <laughs> right? <laughs> <laughs> the struggle is real. The struggle is real, but we're in the Mediterranean. Look at that, everybody. How amazing. <laughs> the water is so turquoise. Just deep breath. It's so beautiful. Deep Hi. Deep breaths. You're in the Mediterranean Sea. That we are. We're not warm. <laughs> we're in the Mediterranean. So, one thing that's really cool is that I am really buoyant in this, this water. You don't even need the floaty. Laura brought hers, but it's really nice. There's hardly any waves. It's just a calm beach. Just a beautiful green flag day here in Ibiza. This is just the perfect way to end our trip. Randy and I got up early this morning to have breakfast in the main dining room because we wanted that experience. We wanted to be able to order more variety, etc. We got there 10 minutes after it closed. So look in your cruise daily every day before you assume that it's open till 9.30 because it closed at 9 today. We ended up at Ocean's, which was fine. That's the 24 hour restaurant where you can get food all day long. Right? Um, so I got a bagel for my bread portion and I asked for extra, extra cream cheese because they give you enough cream cheese to work like butter. I mean, like it barely smears on the, the bagel. She's very distressed at how little cream cheese she's been receiving. So I had to ask for extra cream cheese twice, but they finally brought me enough cream cheese for a normal bagel with cream cheese and it was delicious. Now a normal bagel with cream cheese in Laura's world is like two inches of cream cheese. It's not two inches. It's but it two inches. But it's at least that much cream cheese. It's a lot of I cream cheese. Lie. It's supposed to have a good size healthy schmear. And NCL is not doing it. Not getting not her enough getting cream right cheese. I also saw quite a few other Americans asking for extra cream cheese. I don't know if it's a European thing, an NCL thing, or just maybe, you know, clogged artery thing. <laughs> <laughs> I don't care. I'm on vacation. Yes, we are. So we got Randy in the Mediterranean. Hey, hey. What do you think? 
super nice. The water is extraordinarily blue. A little chilly and refreshing, but hey, you acclimate it's a hot quickly. day. <laughs> you haven't been in here long. You acclimate quickly. Well, we did the beach in Ibiza. Let's check that off the list. The day was beautiful. It was so easy to take a taxi there and back and fairly inexpensive too, about $8 each way. Yeah, less than $10 each trip and super, super easy. The beaches in Ibiza are just, they've got the infrastructure for people to go spend a day at the beach. It was lovely, but we are heading back to the ship now. We are, we came back a little early because we were kind of done with the beach and maybe go hang, hang out at the pool, have a drink, have some lunch, things like that. Walking back to the ship, we passed this quaint little lighthouse and got an up-close view of the whole art from the escape. We think that each NCL ship is so unique, we just love this artwork by Guy Harvey. We were also greeted with some ice water and cold towels right before getting back on the ship. And in no time at all, we were back on the pool deck for some relaxation and mudslides. Spent the afternoon hanging out at the pool deck. Getting a little sun, enjoying the beautiful Mediterranean, having a few cocktails. cocktails. Gonna stay out here a little bit longer, maybe see sail away from Ibiza. It's absolutely gorgeous. And then we're gonna have our final dinner in the Manhattan room tonight. Right, we haven't even been in there this cruise. Not yet. And then Dueling Pianos is gonna wrap it up for us. I hope we get seats in the venue. Um, but it should be a lot of fun. Can't wait. Unfortunately, we do have to pack up tonight, which is the worst part of any worst cruise. Worst part, disembarkation. Okay, so it's our last sail away mm. from our balconies sad, in Ibiza. Sad face Carol. Can't wait for the next one. Yeah, heading back to Barcelona though. Then we're getting on another 13 hour flight. And end back up at to home Carol. very, very late tomorrow night. But we get to see our puppies. Yes, we do. That's the bonus. That is, is the bonus. We get to see bonus. our puppies and we miss them when we're traveling. Yes, we do. Okay, packing up right now and then we're gonna get cleaned up and go to dinner at the Manhattan Room. Off to dinner. We decided to come to the Manhattan Room, which always has live music for dinner. We haven't made it here yet this cruise, and so we decided to do it this time. And look at our amazing view from our table. Absolutely beautiful. We enjoyed a variety of dishes for dinner, including steak and pasta. And the best part is all included in your cruise fare. I like the whole vibe of the Manhattan Room. Yeah, a it's, lot of fun. It's classic American, talking like 20s, 30s, 40s, golden era of the United States where, you know, supper clubs were a thing and people went out to dinner and it was an event because you, I mean, you have anything else to do, this is what you did. Yeah, the live music is nice and now we are just waiting on dessert. Best singer on, the, on this boat is the singer that sings in this group right here. After a delicious dessert, we spent the rest of the night at the Howl at the Moon Dueling Pianos for another round of Meatloaf Who Can't Do Math. Yeah. 
All right, well, that is a wrap on our Mediterranean cruise for Pepper's 50th birthday. Oh, it was an amazing cruise. We had so much fun, but it's time to pack it up and go home. Yeah, we loved every part of this. We especially love Spain. Stopping in France, those were highlights for me. My favorite stop was Palma for sure. For sure. I think for all four of us, it was Palma de Mallorca. Gotta we, come back. We ate all the things. We drank all the drinks. We experienced all of the sights. And uh, we love cruising. We love cruising Norwegian. It was so much fun. It was so much fun. Can't wait to see you next time on Core 4 Adventures. Bye! Show me life, show me love. Make a change, time is up. We can wait for better days, but the days won't come. Show me life, show me love. Show me life, show me love Make a change, time is up We can wait for better days, but the days won't come Show me life, show me love, this is all we got Show me life, show me love, this is all we got Show me love, show me love